I am Anil Kumar sharing with you questions from my subscriber. Thanks to subscribers for participating actively on my YouTube channel and posting excellent questions. I hope this solution will help many others. The question here is, the sides of a rectangular park are in the ratio of 4 is to 3. If its area is 1728 meters square, find the cost of fencing it at rupees 250 per meter. So let's first sketch and define our variables. Let us say this is the rectangular park and its dimensions are uh, L for length and W for width, right? So what we are given here is that ratio of length and width is 4 is to 3. So we are given length is to width is equal to 4 is to 3, right? That really means that if length is equal to 4x, then width is equal to 3x. Do you see that? So if I divide 4x by 3x, in that case, again, I'll get the same ratio, 4 is to 3. Perfect. So that actually is a key to solve such questions. Now let's move forward. If its area is 1728 meters square, that is to say, area, you know, is length times width. Area is given to us as 1728 is equal to length, which is 4x for us, times width, which is 3x. So we can say 1728 is equal to 12x square or we can say that dividing 1728 by 12 what do we get 1728 divide by 12 you could always use calculator but let's try to do it without that we can cancel these two terms 28 is divided by 7 or by 4 4 times 7 so let's divide them by 4 first. So we get 4 times 3 is 12. 4 times 4 is 16, 12, 3, and 2. Now 4 plus 3 is 7. 7 plus 2 is 9. So it is also divisible by 3. So we can divide both by 3. So we get 3 times 1 as 3. And then 13, 3 times 4 is 12. And then again 12. So we get 144. I have purposely done like this uh, since for many students at this level and for a few competitive exams, calculator may not be allowed. Perfect. So I've done it like this. So what we get here is x squared is 144 and therefore x is equal to square root of 144 which is 12. Correct. So let me rewrite here. So what we get here is that x is square root of 144 you know 12 times 12 is 44 so that gives us the value of x as 12 we are only going to take the positive value if x is 12 then length is equal to 4 times 12 which is 48 and width is equal to 3 times 12 which is 36 now we know length and width if we know length and width, we can find perimeter. So perimeter is twice length plus width. Since opposite sides are of equal length, correct? So that gives us twice 48 plus 36, right? So that becomes, that is equal to 6 plus 8, 14, 4, 1, that is 4 and 4, 8. 84 times 2. Is it okay? So that is equal to 8, 16. And perimeter will be in meters. Now, perimeter is the fencing all around this rectangular park. We need to find the cost of fencing. It is 2.5 per meter. So the cost will be perimeter times the rate which is 250 perfect 
So we can now multiply the length which is 168 meters with the rate which is Indian rupees 250, 2, doll, 2 rupees and 50 cents, right? So that cost is in Indian rupees. And then we get our answer. Now, without calculator, how do we do this multiplication? Well, one way is 25 is a quarter, so you could help working with that, right? So, so there are a couple of ways here to work with. You know, 25 is equal to 100 over 4, right? So 2.5 will be like 10 over 4. So you could divide by 4, multiply by 10. You could do that too. You could do something like this. Or two and a half times, right? So you could multiply this by two first. So let me do this work here. We have 168 times two, which is two eight sixteen six one, two six twelve and one thirteen three one, two one two and one three. This is twice, correct? And 0.5 means half. So when we do 168 times half, we get this 0.5. Half of this is 84. So when you add this up, you get your result. 6 plus 4, 10, right? 1. 4 plus 8, 12. 1. We get 420, right? So, so what we get here is 420. So 2 and a half times is 420. And therefore, our answer is cost is rupees 420 right so that is how such problems can be solved so the key here is whenever the ratios are given to us we can always say that the that the value is 4x and 3x right so that becomes the ratio and now i think straightforward thanks for sharing such a question and i hope that helps Thank you and all the best.